Sarah here with the Athlete Center. Today I'm going to be talking to you about scapular control or shoulder blade control. Okay, This is kind of like a marker that you can use to see if you have control over your scapula. This drill is also good if you're looking to improve function of the stabilizers of the muscle or of the shoulder, sorry. So for example, if you have pain with shoulder flexion or pain with overhead movements, this exercise is really great to start waking up some of those small stabilizer groups to help you that are needed to go into positions like overhead. Okay, so this is called taper, tabletop scapular control and it's a very straightforward exercise. I'm gonna show it to you from the side so you can see. So I'm in a tabletop position Right off the bat, I'm activating my core a little bit, okay? So I have a little bit of tension in that core. I'm also using my glutes a little bit in this position. And why I'm doing that is to isolate movement of the shoulder. So I wanna minimize any movement anywhere else but in my shoulder. From here, my elbows stay straight the entire time, okay? And the first thing I'm gonna do is I'm gonna draw my chest towards the ground and squeeze my shoulder blades together. So you can think about having a pencil in between those shoulder blades. You're trying to squeeze that pencil. From there, I'm pushing my chest away from the ground and trying to get the back of my shoulder blades to touch the ceiling. I'm gonna draw my chest down and push down. Draw and push, draw and push. Take a video of yourself doing this because it can be kind of hard to know if you're doing it right if you're not used to kind of tuning into your body or if you don't have any um, more developed body awareness okay if that feels good and you want a little bit more of a challenge we can go up onto the toes in that tabletop position so instead of being restful here i'm going to tuck those toes under just increases the demand of the core a little bit and then it's the exact same thing push, or sorry, pull, push, pull, push, pull, push. Like I said, this is an awareness exercise, so practice makes perfect, okay? Maybe the first time you do it, it happens with my patients all the time, there's only a tiny little bit of motion, but over time, through repetition, more and more motion becomes available, and your shoulders start to stop hurting. Have fun with this one, guys.